attracted by these floodlights here. But today, not too many. But one got into his eye anyway. He's good, he's good now. And, uh, well, down the leg side. He tried to, tried to do something, I don't know. But this is not going to do well. This is not really going well. Three overs for Afridi prior to this. Just giving away, giving away nine runs. That's absolutely ten runs. Just ten dots. Nine runs and ten dot balls. So that, that's absolutely fantastic. That's the eleventh dot ball into his fourth over. Uh, for a young kid, he's just, I don't know how old he is, but I'll try and find out from Dalima, our, our scorer. Uh, old, uh, I mean, Hajjul Abidin Afridi is. Afridi, well, he's trying his best, and he's doing pretty well. He just pulled on the off stump, uh, slightly shorter, but the batsman tried his best. Tried to whack him, but uh, it didn't connect it properly. Let's a look at uh, our control room. Oh, you see the, a lot of people concentrating on the work there. It's a, it's a job very well done. All the men behind the cameras, the unsung heroes of this uh, broadcast, the telecast, and, uh, and appeal. Well, he's cleaned him up, actually. He didn't need to appeal. He was celebrating. He went for a wild swing and did for out the Beat the bat completely and hit Timber. That's another big strike for the young man. Just 19 years old. Look at the smile on his face. He's cleaned up for out the Very clever bowling. You must say that because he just put the ball on the leg stump. Uh, let the best for free his arm hit, but there was no space left for him, so he just tried his shots, one of the world shots he couldn't connect, and he was bold, completely beaten bad and bad. Another setback uh, brings in Shoikot now. The Sheikh Jamal team will be passing themselves. Something has got to happen, has got to happen uh, very, very quickly. Their supporters can feel that they've got the game under control and they feel that they might go and win this one, but uh, you never know, you never know. Because Farhad Reza is still there. Played that wonderful cameo with the bat in the semi-final and uh, maybe he's trying to replicate that. If he can succeed, he can take his team to that target of 158. They're asking him to climbing very quickly, very, very quickly. And what he'll have to do now, he'll have to do, he'll have to take all, all kinds of risks right now because he'll have to couple, a couple of sixes and a couple of fours. You never know, it can happen anytime. If he, if he can do that, it'll be a good thing for batters. Two more deliveries left, and uh, Shoika, the new batsman, is on strike. Waits, tries to swing it away, does not make uh, the requisite contact. Once again, hands on head for the bowler. This young man has really been impressive. Shoikot, the new batsman. Not, no time really for him to settle down. They're running out of overs. And as you mentioned, the run rate, required run rate, keeps on creeping up. Gone up to 13.14. Extraordinary now. Can't afford to hang back. You've got to go full hog. Go for it. Hey, oh, hey, hey, good hey. bowling. Just stuck around the corner. Another single. A wicket taking over completed. He completes his quarter of four overs. That is Minhajul Abedin. A freedie. And at the end of the 14th over, it's 78 for four.